Greetings. This presentation covers attaching documents to customer records using the document indexer subsystem. Before attempting this process, you should ensure that your Eclipse system has been set up with the document imaging companion product and that the document indexing has been configured correctly with the uh, document storage locations and the document profiles necessary. Once you're assured that document imaging has been set up correctly, uh, then go to uh, Maintenance and to Customer Maintenance uh, and select the particular customer built to or shipped to that you're going to be attaching documents to. Once you're in the appropriate customer record, from the drop-down menu select Imaging and Index Images. Uh, notice before you start in the upper right hand corner you see that little blue solar star icon there there is usually an indicator if there's already existing documents that have been attached there'll be a little little graphic that shows up next to that to indicate that there are other documents attached as well select the image or document that you have previously scanned and saved to your desktop or that you may have worked on and saved to your desktop uh, just about any variety of files can be attached using the indexing, but uh, try not to attach very large files or any files that you intend to have to edit later. Once the document or image is selected, then you may want to change the image description to something more useful, more descriptive for the next person to come along, and be sure to uh, change the document profile to Docs to select the appropriate uh, storage location that's the final destination for the file. Uh, when prompted to whether, whether to replace the current description with the default, select no or else it'll wipe out what you just wrote in in the image description. Once you've done all that, select the index button and you might see a little pop-up. It's only up for a couple of seconds that mentions that it's attaching the file and then the uh, attachment indexing window will disappear and the final result you should see in the customer maintenance screen now the little icon that shows up next to the solar star that is an indicator that there are now attached documents onto that record. Clicking on that attached imaged icon at any future date will present you with the uh, drop-down menu and allow you to select which of the documents if they're multiples that you want to view and uh, a double click will go ahead and open that up either in an image viewer or it'll open up the uh, document directly into the host program. Uh, whatever you do, do not try and edit the file and save it back. That'll muck up things badly. Uh, so if you have to edit something, the, save a copy to your desktop, edit as needed, and then attach the edited document back to uh, the record if necessary. And this concludes our presentation of attaching documents or images to the customer maintenance record. Thank you for your attention.